Uh, Jack Misty and Solid Rose turning up. Now, Solid Rose, a former Revolver winner. And, uh, a lot riding on that, then. Well, I say Revolver. He's, he's, uh, he, he won in Tekken. Ah. But he came... I can't remember who came second or third out of these guys with uh, in Dead or, in the Dead or Alive tournament we, we held on that day. But either way, these guys are both very, very good. Okay. Um, I don't know who um, Simon Droz uses. For those of you in the chat who remember, the, you second fans, you might remember that District G held uh, an Invitational and they did a poll to see who would win one of the spots in this invitation. And, it was a, and Solid Rose's inclusion was a very hotly discussed topic because he's got a lot of skill. <laughs> well, let's see if this um, skill uh, trans translate over to Dead Like 6. Well, we'll see. Be interesting. I'm sure it'll be fun. Now, I have no idea who Solid Rose is going to choose. People just use standard controls in the game. Seriously. Back in my day, right? Back Ooh, in Ooh, Mary Rose, here we go. Back in my day, you had the arcade controls, and that was it. There was none of this, you know, custom button nonsense. Uh, so it doesn't help that um, Dead or Alive um, actually changed its button controls like midway through the series. As really? Well. Did they? Yes. Okay. So uh, initially, uh, on the Dreamcast, for example, uh, if you have the diamond um, formations, uh, Square uh, would um, punch, triangles kick, and X was hold with circle being the, uh, the throw button. Yep. And uh, basically that was for Dead Alive 2 and 3. And then um, afterwards they changed it so, so that um, square was hold, triangle was um, punch, and square was kick. So they basically just rotated it slightly. So depending on which game you actually got into, it can, it can change to like um, which one you prefer. Like I prefer the really old school style. Right. Now, I don't know anything about Mary Rose. Is she a fairly new character? Uh, she was introduced in Dead or Alive by Ultimate as a DLC character skin. But uh, she is absurdly popular. She looks like Lucky Chloe. She's got that weird she stance thing. She predates that. Oh, I know that, you know, but she looks like her. Uh, she uh, is a bit of a, a diminutive character, shall we say. But uh, yeah, she's uh, very, very popular um, in terms of um, the characters. Uh, mostly just uh, for her design rather than to play as. Yeah. You don't see too many Mary Rose players. Now I've got to wonder if this is uh, Solid Rose's main, or if uh, if he loses, he'll make a, uh, a character selection. Oh, that was nice. Did, Did you see that pop? Yep. Uh, that's uh, one of the main features of Mary Rose and the individual quick side offset. Right. But uh, Misty going straight in with a full fatal fatal combo there, massive damage, and my Rose just coming in there saying, "No, I'm just going to smack it off." <laughs> Quality. See, this actually looks quite bad because she looks like she's like about twelve, <laughs> and this big burly man is there, you know, pummeling her face. Proper bullying. Do you know what I mean? Upside down goes um, pretty another good point. So quite a lot of uh, people um, today have been uh, quite fixed in their Dead Life 5 style, so not all of them have been uh, using uh, the meter as they, as they could do. Yeah. So you haven't seen too many uh, break holds, especially, and uh, maybe just a few um, break holds here and there. Is this one of the first DOA games which has been? Because I don't know yes. 5. This is the first game um, in Dead Life 5 had meter. Dead Life 5 had. Uh, the, uh, something similar to the raid system. In fact, I think uh, Tekken actually copied it off the him, wow. where um, once you lose about half your health, yeah. uh, then your life bar starts flashing and you unlock a more powerful version of certain moves, yeah. which had uh, all the um, cutscenes and stuff um, involved in that. So they took that out and uh, put meter into this game. And, uh, it's a bit divisive, I'd say. Hmm. You know, I've got to say, this makes me a little bit as a father. 
seeing this little girl getting beat up. <laughs> this does not reflect our core values. Would, would it be different if the girl would be seeing the entire day up well, yeah, Well, yeah, it's, you know, it's probably like Hollywood violence. It's a bit unbelievable, yeah. but it's, <laughs> it's fine. Yeah, we all, we all saw Kick Girl in, uh, what's it, um, Kick Ass. In it. So. Well, mind you, that was awesome. Yeah, that was you, awesome as hell. Yeah, no, you, you mean Tim Little Girl? <laughs> yeah, but she was like a tomboy, do you know what I mean? This is like a girly girl. <laughs> You see, look, all tumbling away like she's. Just been <laughs> so, I shouldn't even like. Uh, Sandra is then struggling now. To really, make a dent in the, the missing defense here. Yeah. Oh, blocks with punish there. And the barrage continues. So far, Sandra hasn't really found an answer for Heate. He's not um, taking advantage of the user either. No, so. but then it's a new thing. People don't really know how and when to use it, do they? So you can't really expect something like. Oh, yes, but having said that, um, it's kind of like a smart bomb in Schmucks, you know. If you die with a load, a load of smart bombs, I think you're frosted and you're not quite doing things right. Yeah, it's so, true. Same in this game. Like, if you if you die on four meters and not having used any of it, it's not quite. Oh, that's a nice good side step there. I you, love uh, that part. Nice little. No, nope. couldn't uh, quite capitalize. Ah, see, that was a break hold, but um, unfortunately there was no attack going through there. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, oh. Oh. Todd Bruce did manage to get something going there. He uh, did. Just, it just wasn't enough. He did. Maybe this character's. I can hear the wind cry. Play losers. We play the losers until we get to winners. Winners fire. Okay, so that was uh, one of my bracket bosses just asking me what uh, I would like.